I am number one, not number two If I'm not the one, I'm uncomfortable See the competition I've been running through Leveled up, I only see him in my rear view Switch! Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' I'm winning, get buckets from the court side to the nosebleeds Yeah, they love it I'm winning, get buckets from the first in and the last out, see me coming. First take, I'm hotter than hot, hotter than some boiling water, I bubble the pot. Team full of ballers, baby, we winning a lot. I'm like Curry with the rock when I get to my spot. I'm tapping in, I'm passionate, this is what passion is. This here, nah, this is no accident. From the start to the finish, I'm cashing in. I am number one, not number two If I'm not the one, I'm uncomfortable See the competition I've been running through Leveled up, I only see him in my rear view Switch. Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' I'm winning, get buckets from the court side to the nosebleeds Yeah, they love it I'm winning, get buckets from the first in And the last out, see me coming Been popping, sports center from a little I was watching Spin a bag like I'm Rafa, call that top spin How could I not win? This is top ten From the bottom, got a sniff out the top wins I sit back, reflect, and do it again Hardest milli is the first, now we got ten Talking ten, 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 ten times ten and again I am number one, not number two If I'm not the one, I'm uncomfortable See the competition I've been running through Hello and welcome to Notre Dame Tonight, underneath the outstretched arms of Touchdown Jesus The Fighting Irish are set to open another season at home There's nothing quite like a great rivalry matchup in college football The bitterness, the intensity, the lifetime of memories that will come as a result of what we're about to see in this one. As we'll see a squad from the ACC, the Pittsburgh Panthers, taking on the 14th ranked team in the land, the Notre Dame Fighting Irish. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Reese Davis, joined here in the booth, as always, by David Pollock and Jeff. And it'll come out to the 25, no attempt at a return. The Irish offense will take the field to start this game. There are always butterflies to start a game is up at night dealing with the transfer portal. Because they got to make sure that everybody in their locker room. And the pass run. Looking downfield and he needs a bunch. Avoids pressure. He'll pull it down and run. And stampeding through the defense. First down sack can be a drive killer. Now it's second and 13. He's looking to throw. Unloads to the wideout. Makes the grab. On the option. The pitch. And he'll glide his way in for the score. Touchdown, Irish! And that touchdown just got this sort of place going. Didn't you got everybody doing the Irish jig. Touchdown, Jesus is happy. You got the leprechaun, he's dancing. The energy in this place right now is on another level after that score. No wonder this is such a tough place to come in and try to get a win on the road. Sticks him still on his feet. Solid pass play at second and three. The give to the lone running back. At the 35, he's loose. Nothing but green ahead. The 20. He's at the 10. And he eluded the defense and he'll take it all away. Touchdown, Fighting Irish. Man, this guy is such a weapon because he's so dangerous if he gets into the second level. Great vision, and then David shows you the speed. Just straight wheels, erasing angles. A lot of times when you're chasing guys that are so fast like this, you're like, I got him, I got him. No, I do not. What a big, long touchdown run. Had those stats, young fella. It'll be third and short. 
Looking for a man. It's Holstein. Hit as he throws. On target to the left. Play with some sense of urgency if they're not going to give up any points here before the end of the half. Fires to the middle. A strike downfield. He'll just keep slinging it. He's got it and still on his feet. Oh, it's out. There's a live football. Now look what I found. He's looking to throw. And he strides his way into the end zone. Touchdown, Panthers. Man, I tell you what, that passing touchdown, man, that should spark this whole team. Like, the comeback is more than on now. Like, they got the touchdown. They cut into the lead. You, you want to get a stop and go into the half, get all the juices, all the excitement, and be like, listen, the passing game's rolling. We got this. The comeback's in full effect. They're lining up on first and 10 from the 38. Used the play fake. Now to throw. Got his man on the right. Finally run out of... I know they want to slap the ball away, but if you can't do it and force the incompletion, you've got to at least make sure you're able to drag him down to the ground as soon as he catches the ball. They make the stop at the five-yard line. Now a chance to pull even first and goal as we get late in the first half. Dropping back, it's Holstein. Makes the grab, and he's into the end zone. Touchdown, Pitt. Yeah, and the passing game comes through, man, and we need more of that in the second half. An extra point away from tying this football game. You trailed a little bit in the first half, stayed calm. If this passing game can continue to heat up, look out in the second half. On second down, he'll try to make the connection this time. Complete in the middle. And the defense doesn't let him get loose, and that's going to wrap things up here in the half. That's going to wrap up the first half here, and now we join Kevin with the halftime update. Fellas, what an environment there today. All the animosity and flat-out hatred that comes with a good old-fashioned rivalry game on display in that first half. An entertaining first half, and we've got a multi-possession lead to break down thanks to the surgical precision of this offense. Might honestly take more time to talk about what didn't work than what did. The running game, the passing game, gadget plays have worked. Now it's just a matter of finishing the job. That said, let's get back to the field and our guys in the booth to see who comes out on top of this rivalry contest. find out here on third down he drops to throw he's got an open man major gaps in the looking for a crease it's Reed and the ball is loose and live in the backfield defense covering it up and not letting the offense get it back it's a turnover I love those smashes where you can hear it up here. Reese. Goodness gracious, you can hear the contact. Such a big lick. The offensive guy doesn't hold on to the football. Huge momentum swing. Big turnover forced by the defense. Oh, he's ready to take a shot. And it's caught inside the 15. Run out of bounds after the long game, but they've got it now first and goal. Well, how about the offense setting that play up? We've seen earlier in the game a couple of shorter throws. They're just trying to suck those safeties closer to the line of scrimmage, anticipating that they would get an opportunity to take a shot. They called the perfect play at the perfect They'll try to get it in with the run. Touchdown, Notre Dame! And that one will give him the lead. That trip to the end zone is 25th career touchdown. He's been productive, just has a nose for the end zone. Just 
Jokic made big play after big play for his offenses, and that's 25 touchdowns, Palmer, on the ground for the big fella. Pretty impressive, too, when you consider when you get close to that end zone, the defense is expecting run, they're loading the box, and still this guy's been able to find his way in. 25, it's a nice number. And it opens up the whole offense at your disposal. Receiver looks it in, it's complete. And here's all different receivers to his tight ends, to his running backs. Really has the ability to spread it around. And now over 300 yards. Still some time left. Here comes the rush, and they've got it wrapped up at the 28. All right, offense has got to be better. You've done a nice job getting the football to this point in the red zone, but now you can't go backwards. You've got to be able to get rid of the football if it's not there, and that was a terrible play giving up the sack. Back to pass. It's Holstein. The freshman able to get home with the sack. Pretty nice as a defense, right? When you can go nickel, put five DBs on the field and not have to blitz anyone, trusting your front four to get the job done on third down, and they do it right there getting the sack. Moving the running back, forcing the defense to adjust. He is smashing people. A huge pickup on the play before he goes out of bounds, but the question is, will it stand? There is a penalty marker on the field. I think, David, on this drive, the quarterback's just got to settle down. These last few drives, looks like he's seen ghosts. We've seen him force the football. He's missed a couple of... Second half. Here's first and ten. Looking to throw at Tolstein. Good quickness to grab it off the bounce. They get him down. They saw exactly when that ball was spit out. You saw the defense fly to the football. And he'll sprint in for the score. Touchdown, Pittsburgh! That trip to the end zone ties us up. And tying up is exactly what these two teams should do. They look just like mirror images. No doubt. Two big boys going at it, making big plays. Who's going to make this play late in the game to take their team over the top? Nice individual effort. Your turn to answer. Big battle today. Kansas was able to cap off a close one in Lawrence with a narrow victory. And that's the mark of a solid program. Pile up wins, build on games like this. It uses their second timeout of the half as they try to get their act together. And on fourth down, here comes the field goal unit. And this to take the lead, and it's getting late. That is no good. And in the final quarter of regulation, we remain tied. Inside their own 20. Off the bootleg, wants to toss it. And the ball comes out. What a disastrous play. And what a break to get that football back at this third aim, lining up to punt it away. Woo. Deep breath, right? Man, you, you fumble that thing, you cough it up. You're like, oh, I really appreciate you, brother. I can't take Try it again on second down. He's looking to throw. Still moving to his right, trying to make a big play. On the move at the 30. Timeout is called by the offense. They have 14 scrimmages to 28. That'll make it a 45-yard field goal attempt and a big chance to win the game. That is no good. After that failed field goal attempt, fellas, still tie ball game. You just have to wonder about the headspace this kid is in right now. That's now his second missed kick. If he had made that one, they would have had the lead. He needs to go clear the cobwebs on the sideline and get his confidence back. For overtime, Dave. And that's the question. Don't make the mistake here. You can be aggressive, Jesse, but you better be cautious. Yeah, I, I think taking a shot, I feel pretty good about it here. You know, give your guys an opportunity. Crazier things have happened. All right.
right, guys, so here we go in overtime. And just to refresh everyone's memory, alternating possessions starting on the opponent's 25. And it's so nice to be on defense first, to, to set the tone, to understand what you need. Try to hold them to a field goal. The offense knows they can do their job to go out and get a win. Just two possessions, Paul. We're like, you got to be at your best. Yeah, and I love the new rules, too, because in the third overtime possession, it goes to alternating two-point play. Not a lot of ground to cover and not much to defend. A big third down in the red zone. He wants it all. And he can't put three on the board and take the lead in overtime. Third and short in college football today. You see so much more pass than you used to. The offense stays aggressive, and I think they stay aggressive because they know they're in field goal range. They got that three in their back pocket. Now on third down, and at the very least, trying to get into a little better field goal position. He turns it loose to the left. And that one did sure they avoid any hint of a mental lapse here in overtime and now on fourth down they will put it on the shoulders of the kicker to save them with his foot can, can. they're looking for an advantage to the right trip to pay dirt. This dude has shown you a little bit of everything. What a great bat. They'll run the option. They can't convert. And the lead remains at six. And now they'll have to go on defense. Touchdown. He'll come out throwing on first down. On target over the middle. Down a touchdown. They have to get it in the end zone. To the air, it's Holstein. Quarterback floating away from pressure. Touchdown, Panthers. That ties it up here in double OT, and now they can win it. Man, what a great response by this offense. Going down the field, scoring the touchdown. Now, I've got to go for two. I know the new overtime rules. They changed this years ago. Jesse, you should work on this in practice. What's your go-to two-point play right here? I'll tell you, after running the ball as well as they did on that last touchdown, I could see them doing it again. I think they've got confidence in the big fellas up front to get... Starting in double overtime, and this one would win the game. Looking to throw. He got it in there, and we are tied again. Is this fun or what? We're headed to triple OT. It always comes down to a few key plays in a game like this, but to lose in overtime, just an absolute kick in the gut. It's a kick in the gut, and you remember those exact plays, Reese. The things I could have done a little bit better or the ball could have bounced my way. Just a few of those little plays make the difference in winning or losing a ball game. And I think as players too, David, you know, when you watch the film, you didn't do enough, but you definitely had some positives out there on the field. Guys stepped up, guys delivered, and put you in a position to win. In the end, moving forward, when the game's on the line, you got to be able to close games out. That's going to do it for us. For Jesse Palmer, David Pollock, our entire broadcast team, I'm Reese Davis. This has been another presentation of EA Sports College Football.